Good morning, Sagittarius. This message is for you. This is a general message, so make sure to take a look at your sun, moon, and rising for other messages. And make sure to like and subscribe. Hit the bell so that you don't miss any further uploads. I'm currently filming upstairs today because it's a day after Thanksgiving. And I have family downstairs, so I'm trying to find a quiet spot. Okay. Sag, we have Earth Magic. And we have Divine Matrix. Okay, Sag. What are you up to right now? I hope you guys had a wonderful holiday season filled with lots of love, family, and gatherings. So many things to be thankful for during this time. Okay, and sad you have be bold and make the first move. Okay, now Sagittarius, what do you need to make the first move on? What is going on in your situation? Let's get some tarot and try to clarify this for you. What messages do we have for Sagittarius? Spirit guides and angels give us a message for Sagittarius. Okay, let's get some tarot. The Nine of Cups. Okay, Sag. Your main energy is the Nine of Cups. You have the Strength card. The Five of Wands. And the lovers. Okay, Sag. You also have the Two of Pentacles. That's actually the energy that I was feeling when I was meditating on your energy. Let's pull this forward a little bit so we got more room. And the Ten of Wands. Okay, Sagittarius. So I'm feeling like you are manifesting things in your life at the moment. I feel like you are setting your intentions on what it is you exactly want. Um, I also have this feeling that you're just sitting back and waiting at the moment um, for these to transpire if that makes any sense but I feel like you are I feel like you're strong in your position um, I feel like you've got a lot of support strength um, you're currently going through challenges, but I'm not seeing that they're huge challenges that you can't overcome, um, especially with this Nine of Cups energy at the top. I feel like you're bursting with energy um, trying to get to the finish line. That's what I'm feeling for you, Sagittarius. 
And now you do have the lovers. So if you're not in a relationship, this could be a relationship coming towards you. If you are in a relationship, I feel like your relationship is moving to the next level. Um, but I do feel like you're setting priorities. You're trying to find balance in your situation because um, during this time you're feeling a little bit overwhelmed. So um, also with that two of Pentacles energy, it is also the time to kind of watch your spending. Keep an eye that you don't go beyond your means is what I want to say. Move these up a little. Okay. What other messages do we have for Sagittarius? What other messages do we have for Sagittarius? The Two of Cups. So this is definitely love. Um, if you're looking for love, if you're not looking for love, it looks like <coughs> love is definitely coming in with you with the lover's card and the two of cups if this isn't love this is something that's already in your life this could be your friendships your companionship but i do feel like you're looking towards the future for this to build on this energy i feel like you're making plans for the future you're looking towards what could be And you got the Nine of Swords in reverse. So I feel like you're you're finally coming out of any fear and anxiety. I feel like if you had any depression in the month of November, due to any reason, I feel like you're finally coming out of that. I feel like you're finally see the light at the end of the tunnel and you're kind of opening the door to your discovery uh, but I, I feel like this fear anxiety depression I feel like it's ending yeah you have the seven of cups I mean excuse me the seven of pentacles so I feel like you're doing a lot of work and you're waiting for uh, you're waiting to see the results from the your efforts you have the king of one maybe this is this love that's coming in the king of wands he's very passionate he's very loving he's very sexual um, he's also very assertive very bold very charming so if this is a king of wands coming in for you I feel like you're going to be going on a ride a very sensual ride, Sagittarius. Okay, at the bottom of the deck, you have the Three of Cups. So I feel like you're not done with your celebrations yet. Um, and this is your season, Sag. So um, you could be celebrating your birthdays, celebrating other events. But I feel like you're in the mood for celebration. And this may be where you find this two of cups or this lovers okay Sag let's get a little bit of clarification for this there's a few cards that I want to clarify what advice do we have for Sagittarius for this general reading what advice do we have for Sagittarius we have the sun. So, Sag, I feel like whatever you're going through, whatever you've been through in the past, I'm, I feel like you're coming out of that, like I said. And I feel like you finally see the light at the end of the tunnel. Um, I feel like this is going to be a very happy month for you. This is going to bring you a lot of satisfaction, a lot of success in what you're doing. And you have the Page of Wands. So I feel like communication is key. Communication is going to bring everything forward. And um, whatever moves that you're making, 
the communication is going to come in pretty swiftly, I believe. You have the Ace of Swords. Yeah, so definitely new beginnings in the situation. You also have the Magician at the bottom, Sagittarius. So, you have everything that you could possibly need in order to make whatever it is you're trying to bring forward come to life. That's what I'm feeling. You're bringing something to life. This could be in love. This could be in your finances. This could also be in your career. But I feel like you're bringing something to life. And the card that we have is, there is nothing sexier than, and, than my authentic truth. Yeah, so someone, someone actually finds you very, very attractive right now, Sagittarius. And they find it so attractive that you're honest and open and you're giving them that Ace of Swords energy. You are bringing the truth unapologetically. You have, I am the dreamer of my dream. Exactly. You are the creator of whatever you want it want in your life you can make your life exactly the way you want it with work and dedication you can become you can manifest you can do anything in your dreams realize that and know that Sagittarius you have that ability you are the magician Remember, we saw the magician at the bottom of the deck. You are the magician. You can bring forth anything you want. You can bring that down to earth and manifest it. Beautiful energy. One more card. My faith has the power to turn trauma into healing, conflict into growth, and fear into love. Beautiful Sagittarius. At the bottom of the deck, I just want to show you this one. At the bottom of the deck, it says obstacles are detours in the right direction. Yeah, so sometimes if we go through challenges and we go through things that um, we see as obstacles. And they're just a detour to get to our final destination. It's not that to say that this challenge or this obstacle is going to stop us from everything that we want to do. No, it's just a detour. So we can still get to where we want to be. We just may go through a few do detours. We may go a different route, take a new perspective. So yeah. Happy journey for you, Sagittarius. I think it's going to be kind of an exciting ride for you this month. So enjoy. Enjoy the month ahead. Now, if you like this reading, please like and subscribe. Hit the bell so that you don't miss any uploads. And make sure to take a look at your sun, moon, and rising for um, more detail, more clarity. Sometimes your other signs can have uh, more information for you or can resonate more. And many blessings to you, Sagittarius. Love and light.